Understanding model-based testing. The software applications we're interacting with today are all around us and interconnected into more and more complex distributed software systems. They support major functions in our day-to-day -day life and environment. Some of those applications are even safety critical. A failure of such an application could lead to catastrophic consequences. To thoroughly verify such applications and systems in a reasonable amount of time, powerful approaches are required. One such approach is called model-based testing. Systems to be verified represented by source code or UML diagrams can be modeled in a mathematical formalism known as finite state machines. Such machines can then be used to automate the verification of the system they represent. When source code and UML diagrams are not available, the system log files can be used instead to infer the finite state machines. When all these information sources are available for a given system, they can be exploited jointly in order to obtain a more refined and precise state machine. The more complex a system to model, the more states will usually be present in the state machine. Automated validation tools requiring little human intervention can process the finite state machines and produce a proof that the modeled system indeed behaves as expected. Bugs, security issues and potential crashes leading to undesired outcomes are also detected using such approach. From model to tests, Another possible use of the finite state machine modeling is to generate the minimal number of tests to run on the system in order to ensure its correct functioning. Test generation and execution can, in this case, be entirely automated. To sum up, formal approaches are a way of generating mathematical models for software systems from which proofs of correctness and minimal test sets can be produced. The final goal is to ensure that the systems exhibit only the expected behaviors and never does something undesirable. The Advanced Software Modeling and Development team at CRIM has been working for more than a dozen years in the domain of using models to validate and test software applications and distributed systems. Its expertise allows the team to help software developers achieve a higher confidence in the quality of their products.